Hey everyone, welcome back to Engineering Education. For this next video, we are asked to determine the energy required to move a 3.25 microcoulomb charge from position 501, so that's five units in the x direction, zero units in the y direction, and one unit in the z direction, to position 004. And we are inside an electric field of 234, so that's an electric field two units in the x direction, three units in the y direction, and four units in the z direction. So as always, pause the video, give it a shot, and we'll go over the answer in a bit. So to go ahead and solve this, we can go to the FE handbook. And on the very first page of the electrical and computer engineering section, we have the definition of work done on a particle. So the work done by an external agent in moving a charge Q in an electric field from point P1 to point P2 is given by this equation here, where Q is the charge, E is the electric field, and L is the distance. So we're going to write that same equation on the next page. So writing that integral, we have work done is equal to negative Q integral E dot DL where it's going to go from point P1 to point P2. So here we have the definition of work, and the units of work is joules. So solving this equation here, this is equal to minus Q E dot L, where L is going to be the final position minus the initial position. So I guess we can call them, let's say, P final minus p initial and that is equal to the final position is 004 004 minus the initial position is 501 and therefore we get negative 503 as our l and q is given E is given, so then the work done is equal to minus 3.25 microcoulombs, and then you have the E field here is 234, and then you're going to do the dot product with minus 503. All right, so that's three and a quarter microcoulombs. And then we could do the dot product here. Two times negative five is negative 10, plus three times zero is zero, plus four times three is 12. And then that gives us negative 3.25 microcoulombs multiplied by two. So this ends up equaling negative 6.5 times 10 to the negative 6 joules. And that is our answer. So that tells us that in order to move this point charge, which has a charge of 3.25 microcoulombs from position A to position B, position A being 501, and position B being 004, inside this electric field 234, it's going to require negative 6.5 times 10 to the negative 6 joules or negative 6.5 microjoules. So, did you guys get that? Let me know in the comments below, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, enjoy engineering. 